Michigan is overflowing with things worth fighting for. Breathtaking dunes and forests, rivers and rocks, bustling cities and small towns filled with people from all walks of life. And of course, 90% of the nation's fresh water. But challenges to our air and water, both from toxic pollution and corporate special interests, have made it so many in Michigan don't have clean water to drink or clean air to breathe, all while threats to our democracy challenge our ability to fight for the changes we want to see. Climate change is already starting to affect Michigan. When we think about the future, a future under climate change is an impoverished planet. When we started this organization, it was clear that what was happening to our environment would be disastrous to our state and to our people. And looking at the landscape of other organizations, we saw a real opportunity to do something different, something desperately needed. When uh, Lisa and I were asked to look at this organization and lift it up, it really was just words on paper. And now it's uh, recognized as uh, really one of the toughest, best, and most effective politically smart environmental organizations in the country. We're not just an environmental organization. The core of our organizational model is to elect environmental champions from the top of the ticket down to local races. And then we turn around and hold those same elected officials accountable for their campaign promises. That's what makes us different. We have the relationships, partnerships, and track record needed to affect change in a major way. Michigan LCV is unique because we have identified that moving with partners that have already been at the work and then partners that have the alignment that in the aggressiveness to attack climate right now. So we have shifted the game. First of all, I never would have been in office in the first place if it wasn't for LCV. I mean, there's just no way. Uh, the support that I received from them and have continued to receive has been astronomical, and their partnership, of course, on policy uh, has been amazing, and their ability to, to bring people together to support the important issues, whether, whether it's, of course, environmentally related or even matters of, of voting rights and democracy. I can't tell you how grateful I am for the work that LCV has been doing in Michigan for a long time, and the culmination of that work, I think, we saw in the outcome of this. What makes Michigan LCV special is that it is the powerful political voice for Michigan's land, land, air, and water and all the people who depend upon it. I think it's our ability to uh, integrate and blend policy matters with local community challenges. And so folks who are dealing with things in their own communities, we're here to help that and I think that makes us unique. I know that when I get information from the Michigan League of Conservation Voters, it's been well vetted, it's been, um, it's documented and it's solid information that uh, I can count on and know that um, the solutions being proposed and the numbers being put forward are ones that work for Michigan. Our team is tenacious and innovative. We're problem solvers and self-starters. And most of all, we live the mission every single day. I don't think I've ever worked with a group like this. Everyone's so passionate about environmental justice issues, equity. MLCV is, is ensuring that Michigan is not only at the forefront of this climate fight, but ensuring that everybody is engaged in the conversation. That's the key. Our dedication to racial justice at MLCV is unique because we found and, and employed people who have a passion for that. We engage on the racial and diversity level by making sure that we get to all corners of the state because all of their votes matter, all of their thoughts matter, all of their stories matter. What inspires me to keep coming back to this work is I think honestly just the sense of community around it. My proudest moment so far, I would definitely have to say this past election because I felt like I'm a part of history in a way, but to also be able to be a part of this team and be able to help connect others to resources so that it can be easier for them to vote, that's an honor, honestly. In the next 20 years, we see Michigan serving as the nationwide model for protecting people and the planet. And with your help, we believe we can achieve it. Michigan, to me, stands out as a state that if you innovate and pass uh, really significant and consequential legislation here, 
it reverberates throughout the country. As the state's leading nonpartisan political voice for protecting Michigan's air, land, water, democracy, and the health of our communities, the Michigan LCV family knows that when people get involved, change happens. We know how to fight and we know how to win. That's the Michigan LCV difference. People-centered power. I think what's more impressive is the human capital that is created not just internally in the organization, but the impact Michigan LCV has creating people all over the state who then are advocates who aren't on staff, who aren't even maybe necessarily members of Michigan LCV, but the impact of Michigan LCV creates that army. So long as there's an army of people that has my back, and so long as that army includes the LCV, I'm gonna be okay. I see the impact that this one small organization has had in a very short period of time and it's just a reminder that we can all have impact and it really reinforces the impact that a small group of really smart dedicated people can have and there's an opportunity for so many people to be part of that. The worst thing in the world is to, to look at the Great Lakes environment or f falling apart, being damaged, being brought down and feeling helpless. MLCV is a way to feel empowered and to be empowered. When you put your money into Michigan LCV, you can rest assured that money is going to be maximized to its fullest potential. The strength of the organization is what allows peace of mind. When we come together, we can make real lasting change. No matter your background, no matter where you live, everyone has a place in this movement. We can't do this without you. Something you should know about getting involved with MLCV is that it can change your life. It certainly did mine.